This video shows you how to integrate your PaySource payroll system with Xero Accounting. This means that when you process a pay in PaySource, the information will automatically go into your Xero Accounting package and show up as a draft invoice there, so it can be matched with payments coming from your bank statement. Click the name of the company at the top of the screen to get back to the company level, and then on the right hand side of your screen, click on the settings button. Next, select Integration here in the menu, and then choose Zero from the list of tabs. Now click Connect to Zero. You'll be redirected to the Zero login page, and you'll be able to enter your username and password to log in. Once you've done that, the system will ask you to allow access. Click on the Allow Access button. A second later, you'll be brought back to the main screen again, and make sure you're back in the Settings area. Now click on Integration again, and check that the Zero integration has been set up. And you can see here that it's now linked. If we do need to disconnect it again so that we can relink, you just click this little cross here to take your connection away from Zero. Next, on the left hand side, click on Costings and choose Yes to send an invoice. Make sure that it shows zero in the accounting software and that the status to begin with is a draft invoice. As I scroll down, I can see the different fields that need to be filled with the chart of account code names. At the top of the window, I can click the refresh button here. That will allow me to download the details from zero. I see the message that says that the account codes are downloaded and now when I scroll down, I can click into each of these fields and select the appropriate name. So I'm going to choose salaries for each of these. Some of these will look different to your codes, uh, you'll just be able to select the correct one. There we go, it's all done. Now I can click the save button at the top of the screen. Now that I've downloaded all the information and assigned it to the codes, when I run a pay, the information will automatically go across into zero. And now when I go up to the run a pay area, I've already got a pay put together. So when I go to the finalize screen at the top, I've still got my usual reports going across the screen, but now there's a costing one. When I select costing, I can see the information that's going to go across to zero as soon as the pay is closed off. We'll find the information in the purchases area at zero as a draft invoice.